Hello, I'm Locke, and taking video is what I'm passionate about. Have been thinking about getting a drone forever, but then I met the Spark, and it's on sale. But this is the coolest bit. I'm a Jedi Master. Still, it flies as good as any other bigger drones. I can't wait to see where technology takes me next. Alright, I hope you get the joke of that video. But anyway, I've got my drone finally. I got the DJI Spark Fly More Combo. And well, you have seen enough unboxing, so I'm not going into detail of it. Actually, I've already opened it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Believe me, if you are buying a DJI Spark, you will want to buy the Fly More Combo because, well, if you're getting a Spark, trust me, you need one more battery and then you need the remote control. You buy the Spark by itself and then add a battery and then a remote control. The price add up that it's almost you can buy the Fly More Combo. And with the Fly More Combo, you got the battery charging dock so you can charge three at the same time. Actually, one more on the drone itself. So at the same time, you can charge four battery. Without this, you have to put it in the drone itself to charge one after one. And then, of course, and then the bag. So you should get the Fly More Combo and then you should get the DJI Care as well. I mean, well, you should consider it. I think it's a good value. What? How much is it? Yeah, for 60 bucks, it covers two accidents. If you crash it or land it in water, they just replace a new one for you. So I think it's a really good value. I've got it, but I'm not saying that I'm going to crash it. I'm really good at flying. I've got good record, but it's just high weeks anyway. I mean, flying a camera on the air, I have confidence it just just give me a peace of mind. Yeah, get DJI Care. Buy a peace of mind. So anyway, this is a video about why did I get the DJI Spark, not the better Mavic and Phantom. Well, I have been saying that I'm going to get a drone. I'm going to get a drone. What makes me suddenly decided? Winter sale, <laughs> hundred dollars less. What's that? A cow going up this high. I don't know they go up that high. Well, seriously, a Mavic, Mavic is great. It's froze up. It's not that much bigger than this. For the price of the Mavic, I have to think about, or I have to seriously think about uh, how many times I would actually fly it if I bought it. And then I just fly it like three times a year. It doesn't, the Mavic is the price of the good mirrorless camera. This is just the price of a phone. I mean, my, actually, my iPhone 10 costs more than this and it don't fly. Obviously, it, it don't go on the web, but there you go. This is more expensive than this. And the winter sale, it just, all right, I just have to get it. You win, DJI. <laughs> Another reason, of course, is light and small, especially when you're carrying it on hiking up onto mountains. Oh, bullshit. I mean, if you know me, I keep talking about light gear. As you can see how thin I am, I'm, I'm like a stick man. Of course, I want the lightest gear possible. But it's windy here. Uh, well, <laughs> well, of course, it's so much easier to carry this up on the hill. And then this is, I think, the best way to carry it because this propeller would catch on things in your bag and I don't want to carry that original case with this because it makes it so much bigger throw it in the bag, protect the propeller, protect the delicate gimbal, this, this tiny gimbal so just like that, put it in your bag, safe oh, got sand in my eye I mean, well, we're talking about how light it is this this is just this is lighter than a bottle of water. Actually, I just find out this bag that comes with the Fly More Combo is really quite neatly. Look at that, the remote control here, the drone here, and then there are two space for your extra battery. You've got like totally three of them. Like here, you've got a space for battery. Just look at it, it's just like the part of the later. 
It's so innocent, so pure. I mean, if you have a Phantom 4, you bring out the big box, bring out the huge Phantom 4 and the huge remote control. The remote control is bigger than that. And then connect your iPhone or iPad on it, wire this and that. Everyone knows you are up to something. It just looks so serious. Why so serious? This, it just looks like a toy car. When I fly a drone, I don't want attention. I don't mean I'm planning to fly this illegally, but if you have been stopped for shooting, but you should be allowed to shoot at the location. You know what I'm talking about. Just don't want attention. Well, when I first heard about the DJI Spark, I thought it only fly indoor. It don't fly well outdoor. Maybe because all the rumors about it is a selfie drone. Turns out it fly really well, even outdoor. I mean, Hong Kong could be pretty windy. It's on the edge of the sea, but it fly really, really well. I mean, I have already flew it in New Zealand by the sea. It concluded really well. Oh my god, I dressed almost exactly the same. Well, anyway, this is when I flew a Spark in Piha Beach, New Zealand. The wind speed limit of the Spark indeed lower than Mavic and Phantom 4. But a normal day like this, the Spark just performed like its breaker brothers. It has almost everything a bigger drone has, like the optical sensing system. I have it directly fly into me. It just stopped there. When I first done the video about Spark, I didn't have the remote control. It disconnected from my iPad, but still able to return to exactly where it took off, just like the Mavic. What else? It even got spot mode. <laughs> the, the spot mode is really scary because look at that. And it even got those intelligent flying mode, which is the quick shot. Target is me, Sun, Zhongli. Go! 3, 2, 1. Hand free. I'm not doing anything, it just shoots the video itself. There are in total 4 quick shots. There's also active track, just like what Mavix has, which I've used to film 2 shots for the spoof ad at the beginning of this video. Might only be 1080 footage, but the footage are good. Shame it doesn't have log profile, low 4K, but if you keep the limitations in mind, you could get good results. That nobody can tell, it is from a toy looking drone. So if you like me who can live without 4K and log profile, I highly recommend the DJI Spark. You can get most features from the bigger drone like Mavic and Phantom in this much smaller, lighter and cheaper package. Thank you for watching. Check out my Patreon if you like this channel so much you want to chip in. Remember to subscribe and turn on the notification bell. I will see you next time.